Yo, what's up guys, and welcome back to a brand new video here on my channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to fix FPS drops in Fortnite or overall improve your performance here in Fortnite Chapter 3 Season 2. And if you guys enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel. This would help me so, so much. Ever any further ado, let's get straight into this topic. And yeah guys, real quick, before we begin with today's video guys, I have so many guides here already on my website guys. You can also search here for stretch resolutions, I just recently made here a pack with the top 5 best stretch resolutions, tools to fix FPS drops and other guides guys. And as mentioned, each and every single post here also leads to a full on YouTube video with the same name and the same thumbnail. So therefore, if you have any questions guys for, I don't know, the best comp settings, I literally have a video for that. Or this FPS boost guide here, I also have a video for that, you know. Just simply click through here guys, you will find so much stuff. Also actually like a block feature on the top guys, where you can see like reviews and other stuff which I update here quite frequently actually. And yeah, now let's begin with the video. So yeah guys, and before we actually change something in Fortnite itself, what I want you to do in the first place is click into a Windows search bar, type in presenter, temp presenter and open up the first file guys. Then it's gonna say here on the top local, then you press F on your keyboard for Fortnite game, saved, config, Windows client and there you can see your Fortnite game user settings. And what I want you to do in the first place guys is go into properties and make sure that the attribute read only is actually unchecked. Then we're gonna open it up guys and it's gonna look a little bit like this here. And then we're gonna simply scroll down a little bit until we find the following common prompt, frame rate limit guys. And as you can see, mine is right now you're on 240, which is wrong guys, because it's literally like proven guys that let's just say that you're running like a 240 hertz monitor, you should actually cap your FPS to something like 247 in the first place. If you're running like 144 hertz, you should cap it to 141 if you're running 360 hertz you should put it to 357 and if you're on anything below 144 hertz guys just simply cap it on 120 because therefore you're going to prevent your pc from working like too much for those extra fps so therefore i'm going to put it here for me personally on 237 guys super super important just simply leave it on that then we're going to scroll down here a little bit until we find pretty much like all the quality settings here in scalability groups and you're going to make sure that your resolution quality is on 100 percent viewing distance on zero and Anti-aliasing quality set to zero as well, shadow quality as well to zero guys, post-processing quality zero, and pretty much all of these here um, copied guys. Then you can see as well global illumination quality, you gotta put on free guys, super important, and reflection quality as well on free. Then once we go down here guys, you can see also all my chat settings, and the ones which it says here pretty much false are uh, like staff which are like small services running in the background which are connected to a Fortnite like the chat or social name, stuff like that. Make sure that all of these are actually turned to false guys. Just as I get them here, you know, hide social name, um, actually on false, auto import friends, also on false guys, show custom tab, also on false guys. Then we have stuff here like show clan tabs, false, hide offline, false, pretty much everything where it says here false guys, you just get a copy real quick, you know, go through. It literally takes like a few seconds only, like post the video right now here and copy everything. And then for the rest guys, these are also my other settings here, which I have. I'm using the performance mode guys with mesh quality set to 2. It's also super important because those are like low meshes which are gonna give you more FPS. And then you're just gonna save the file actually itself guys. Right click onto it, go into properties again and set the attribute here for read only. Press OK and now we're gonna continue in game. And yeah guys, now once we actually go into our Fortnite settings, it's going to say 60 FPS here. But don't be worried there guys because we just put it in our config to 141, 237 or 357. So therefore, yeah, you're gonna feel it literally like once you join into the actual game itself, you will notice it's not 60 FPS. It's just gonna say it here because yeah, we pretty much changed it in the config itself. And then another trick which I actually also utilize is put my 3D resolution to something like 83%. It works perfectly fine guys and it will still look decent, you know, once we actually like join in the game itself again, it will still look decently good and you get a nice FPS increase. And then for the rest, you can also just like copy all of my settings and then I see just in a sec on my desktop. The next step guys, what's also super important is that you're actually going to open up here real quick your Nvidia control panel or AMD panel, you can pretty much do it on both of you guys. And then you can see under adjust image scaling settings with preview, we're gonna select you guys use the advanced 3D image settings, super important. And then we're gonna click on to take me there, you know, it's gonna go here to manage 3D settings. And what you wanna do is real quick copy all of my settings here guys. Yeah, just simply pause the video again real, real quick. You can see everything, just simply make sure to copy all of my settings guys. It literally only takes like a few seconds. I'm just gonna go through it here one more time. 
So you can see it here all perfectly fine guys. So and after we're done with that guys we're gonna go here to adjust desktop size and position and please make sure that for your scaling it actually says here full screen guys. Also super important because the other ones actually will give you more latency guys full screen is the best one. If you do something like integrated scaling or no scaling at all it will actually give you more input delay guys. So therefore please put it on full screen super important. Performance scaling you get it put on display guys not GPU also super important and also make sure to check here over at the scaling mode set by the games and programs. Programs. also super important and then of course also check real quick that you actually run the maximum hertz on your monitor available for me it's 240 hertz here as you can see for you it might set 144 240 165 180 360 something like that and more and more so therefore yeah guys just simply make sure to copy all of these here real real quick and then we pretty much also applied here this best nvidia settings for max performance we're going to close it here Just close camping. Find the tower, maybe. Yeah, let's see, let's see. Bro, what the heck? Wait, I got scout? Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah! Behind the hill! Behind the hill! What the difference? Yeah, yeah, they're inside! 30, 30! You coming? Yeah. I just had to find your launch pad. I'm gonna land here. Yeah. Check it, check it. Yep. Nice. Yeah, his teammate is also in there. Wait, where's his Star Wars yep. friend? Dead. Dead? Dead? And, and Bruh. <laughs> Bro. Last three here. Wait, wait, wait. It's so bad. Aye, aye, aye. Wait, let's say send him. Let's say send him. Yep. The other one is here. Box up. Wait. Dead. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> what is going on? 26 kills. Yeah. We fucking go dead. Let's go. <laughs> Why is it so easy? Bro. <laughs> Monka is fucking lightning cup. And yeah guys with that said, this is it for today's video. If you enjoyed it, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel. This would help me to say so much. And if you still have any more questions, feel free to ask me them down in the comment section below. I try to answer as many as possible. And with that said, have a great day, have a great night whenever you're watching this. And until next time, stay awesome. I'm out. Peace.